One of the great things about Flip is that you can contribute to a presentation or a conversation anywhere as long as you have access to the internet. So to get started, go to your dashboard and click the record button. You may have to allow for the video and the microphone. Once everything has been accepted, you'll see yourself in the video screen right here. And you have the choice to choose any backdrop that you may want, such as simply blurring the background. Or if you wait a quick second, these will load up and you can choose from still backgrounds. You can upload from your computer or you could choose a video background that may interest you. Let's try a couple of these and see what they look like. If I want to upload from my computer, I simply select the computer icon. Now that I've tried a couple of the backdrops, I'll find one that I like and I have a couple options to edit, but I want to go ahead and record my message. So I push this big record button in the middle and it will count down for me. And now I can start my recording. So I can say uh, any prompt that I may want as the teacher, I can add text and style this up any way that I would like, add stickers or pictures. If I choose text, I can type it right here onto my video and move it around anywhere that is less distracting. I can change the colors, the font style, anything like that. And if I don't like it, I can always erase it. On the right hand side of your video presentation, you have a couple other tools. You have filters that you can add to your picture. Your students really enjoy these, uh, but it's important to let them know ahead of time that we don't want anything to be distracting. As a teacher, you also have board options that you can choose and then write on. So this is great if you want to make a presentation. So I'm going to try some graph paper here and I can adjust how much of my background is that particular graph. So using the split screen option here, you can see as I use the slider, I can add more or less of that particular picture or graph. And if I find anything that I like, I can always go ahead and click the draw button and then draw right on top of the graph. So I can change the color. I can change the thickness of the pencil. And once I have it set the way that I would like, all I have to do is draw right on top of the picture. So this is great for a flexible instruction day or distance education. You can go ahead and make your presentation right in this video and then have students respond to it. Once you've finished with your video, click next and you can edit and preview your video. Click next again and you can post to the topic. So maybe you want to add a caption. You can also add a link to anything you may want students to go out to uh, or students can put links to their project. When you're done, click finish and you get this screen here. This screen allows you to create a link to share the video or you can click go to topic and it will view the topic right here on your dashboard. This is where students can go to see all the other presentations that have been done and then they can respond to any videos that they see fit. They simply click the video and then click respond.